we'll get one off the bow so you can show all your friends that you really drove. Cool. Thanks, Tom. Yeah, 21,200 duck boats were built from 1942 until 1945. They were designed by a company called Sparkman and Stevens, and they were manufactured by General Motors Corporation up in Pontiac, Michigan. Now, you know who built the duck boats? I'll give you a hint. While the gentlemen were overseas fighting in the war, who was at home? It's a trick question. Wait a minute. The ladies, right? And as my wife likes to say, that's why they're still here today, because they were built by the ladies. No argument out of me, that's for sure. Now, some of the uses of these things, pretty interesting. They actually transported aircraft on these. They were small military aircraft, and they were called P-38 Lightnings. Now, how it would work was, there was no canopy above your head. How it would work was, with the use of a crane, they would lower the aircraft. They'd put one of the wheels of the aircraft on one duck boat, and then they'd put the other wheel of the aircraft on another duck boat, and then they'd just drive the aircraft to shore. They also used to transport bombs, big ones, four 1,000-pound bombs. And the duck boats were also used as makeshift pontoon bridges. And what I mean by that is, say, for example, they had heavy equipment on that side of the land, and they needed to get it to that side of the land. The solution was pretty simple. Line the duck boats up side by side, and then drive the heavy equipment right on over. So they thought of everything when they designed these things. Now, as we go cruising on down here, I know we're going to get a few others behind the wheel. Who was assigned the number two? We're going to the back deck. Where are we going?